And well, from Pakistan to Nepal, political alignments in Nepal are changing again. This, uh, the 15-month-old government of Prime Minister Pushpa Kamal Dahal Prachanda is all set for sweeping changes with a new alliance of left forces taking over the federal parliament. On Sunday evening, Prime Minister Prachanda had a three-hour meeting with former Prime Minister and CPN UML Chief KP Sharma Oli. They reached a consensus on key issues for the new political alliance. It will be marking the third time in four years that Prachanda's CPN Maoist Center and KP Oli's party will be forging a partnership. They had an alliance first in 2020 and then in January 2023. Along with the Oli's party, other parties are also joining Prachanda's government. The new ministers took oath just hours ago after they met Prime Minister Prachanda. Meanwhile, the Nepali Congress President Sher Bahadur Luba has decided to recall all ministers representing his party from the government. The Nepali Congress is the single largest party in the Nepali parliament after the November 2022 elections produced no clear majority for any party. Now, the latest rift between the CPN Maoist Center and the Nepali Congress was caused by the rival claims over the chairmanship of the Nepal National Assembly. It ultimately broke their deal for a coalition. Our correspondent Saloni Muraka has more. In Nepal, political parties often form a shifting coalition among uh, themselves or get into a power-sharing deal with each other, but frequently fail to demonstrate the level of governance sought by the public. Well, this time, Nepal saw the fall of a government overnight resulting into the two major communist forces coming together to form a coalition government, CPN Maoist Party and CPN UML Party. CPN Maoist Party, which is led by Prime Minister Pushpa Kamal Dahal, has mere 32 seats in the parliament but gets to lead the ruling coalition in the capacity of the Prime Minister. While the largest party, Nepali Congress, with 89 seats in the parliament, has been kicked out of the coalition. While the two major communist forces continue to uh, force their alliances with the small French parties to meet the majority mark in the parliament. While the main challenge that lies ahead of this new coalition is to strike a balance with its foreign policy as it is being led by the communist forces and it has been seen the inclination towards China. Saloni Murarka for Vion World is one in Kathmandu, Nepal. For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.